All right, so uh, the other day I was scrolling eBay, you know, as normal people do, and uh, I ran across something that I knew we had to have. <laughs> Thank you, Bonnie. Yeah. They're ski conversion kits for a quad. So basically, you have the skis, put the uh, little, little hoovers in there, and then they basically just bolt right up to the hub, and then you've pretty much got a snow quad. So that's what we're gonna do today. Okay, so. We can't have trail skis on the wheeler. Yeah, CJ's pretty upset that we're not using uh, the blue CNAs for it on his quad. I just feel like it'd look a lot better, you guys. Think about the performance, too. <laughs> and the performance. Like, honestly, I don't want to take them back off because it's going to take me an hour to get it back <laughs> I noticed this after we filmed the last video with the exosled. Why is it leaking oil underneath your turbo? I don't think we're supposed to look at that, actually. Honestly, that's just one of those things you just... <laughs> It's just one of those yes. things. You just one don't worry, but you're gonna have it on this bigger job. Oh. You put them on the wrong side, genius. All right, that's better. Okay, before we go out, we wanted to show you guys a couple of parts that we threw on the new giveaway sled. So we got some new CNA skis, they hooked us up. Thank you, CNA. We threw a new back bumper on, another aesthetic part. Something that's not quite as aesthetic. New can, which is going to sound about a thousand times better because it had like a literal suitcase on it before, but we still haven't started it yet. So today is going to be the trial run to see just how hard it rips. It's brand new, I don't think, I don't even feel deserving to even ride it, honestly. Well, that's good, because I was thinking CJ would. <laughs> As you're talking, like, I don't feel like I deserve to start using this. Mm, <laughs> just start okay, so uh, this is how we measure the snow depth uh, at the shop. As you guys can see, uh, we have another, about an inch and a half since last time we went snowmobiling, which was terrible. And I think it's gonna be just as terrible today, but at least we got a little fluff to work with. Yeah, we pretty much got an inch of setup snow and then an inch of power. I've been dancing with the stars ever since I'm younger. Trying to play a bigger part, trying to kill the problem. When I'm up and being famous, I just want to range of my favorite color paint. It ain't that kind of game. Right, this is a real moment of truth, though. Is this thing gonna work? It's definitely gonna work. I don't think there's a whole lot that could fail. Yeah. Grab, grab. <laughs> it was a combination of my two favorite activities. Yeah. <laughs> riding four wheelers. 20 minutes ago, you didn't really think like that way, but after riding it. It's fun. It's fun. Come on, Mike, launch that thing. I think it's like all the way cranked up and it's just, it feels like I'm riding a rock. Really? With a lot of horsepower.
fast. This is like angry. Dude, it sounds. Oh, no. it sounds so good when you rip past it. Made a lot of yeah. when I came up this shit. First time that I saw a couple down inside a bag. I just threw a fan to the face and a bitch wanted to date. Then I told her I don't think you'd be a match. It's a big move, we the best. I was down, I finessed. Motherfucker said I wouldn't make a dime. Now I'm on the north side, stunning with a Burberry London. Man, I gotta keep it going when we fine. I try to tell you. I feel like I'm living in a loop. I don't go online and check the news. I got some shit I gotta do. I don't trust on the truth. Watery. Pretty good. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, coming into this, you know, like I said, people have done it before. I thought this was kind of like a novelty thing. Like you put it on just for yeah. fun. Yeah. But like, it's something I can see you running all winter on a quad. Oh, absolutely. How much was the kit? $125. Order me one for mine. Time to pick up a new toy. Well, toys, I should say. Dude, these are fresh. Dude, these are so fresh. If you guys were to get a new bike, what would you get? Honda or Cowie. 250 or 450? Probably a 250, yeah. yeah same. You got some Apache tracks? Oh, sure. That just came in a couple sure. days ago. Sounds good. You guys see boys? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's freaking awesome. Thanks, man. I was actually in one of your videos, I was on campus, and I was yeah, in my was say, Ford Mustang. Really Everyone get the out of the way of this guy. Oh, yeah. You guys like, who the f is this guy? <laughs> God damn it, dude. We do this every time. I mean, this is extra bad, though. Yeah. You guys have a dumpster back here anywhere? Like, what the f are you doing? This guy is like, can you stop wasting my time? It literally could have just fallen right out. didn't even strap him down. The only thing holding this in was well, the plastic. I guess it's strong. That would have been an uh, expensive still. mistake. Well, uh, in case you guys didn't know, Whoa. we got some tracks for the Mav Daddy. All right. Oh. So these tracks are like the most Mac Daddy of tracks you can get for a side by side. And the price reflects that. I think we're almost like a. I want to say almost eight thousand dollars in. That's not to mention the cab enclosure and everything. Yeah, it uh, it was a hefty investment. Not gonna lie, it literally took us like a month to bite the bullet just to buy them. But we thought it'd be worth it because they're going to be literally insane. It's basically a snowmobile skid. So, jeez, dude, they're huge. We're waiting on pretty much like the fit kit to put uh, the track onto the wheel. I don't know exactly what what it is, but apparently you need it. We can't put them on until we have that. Which should be in in like the next two weeks, but we didn't want to wait until that came in, so we just went and picked them up. And now Man. we just have to look at them. We got an enclosed cab coming for it with a heater and a bunch of other goodies on top of that. But imagine, you're gonna be in here just all warm. Okay, so the tracks were 6,300. The fit kit was 800. Pre-filter, 100. And then we have like the enclosed cab, the front bumper, the winch. Uh, full windshield with the wiper coming. I say that trying to flex literally as little as possible because it hurts spending that much money for us. But it's gonna be amazing content. I might get a paycheck by like December. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, God. no, Ken, don't, don't get your hopes up. Hate to blue ball you guys like that. We're just so, but we're just that excited. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's the end of the video, boys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, we just restocked this hoodie at cboystv.com as well as dropped this matching hat. Um, and every $5 you spend gets you entered to win the 600R that absolutely rips. It's gonna be one of yours, so we'll see you in the next video. <laughs> Good, Ken?
<laughs> 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 <laughs>